Welcome back. And I'm sorry about that. My battery ran empty. And you know, I don't edit. So, I think we have to start editing soon because... I don't know. <laughs> but, oh well. It's no disaster, so... Don't worry, it's not your lap it's not your internet or your laptop. Nothing happened. But I just don't edit. Also because I don't know how to edit or what to use or buy a po program for that. Because <laughs> you already have to spend so many things on programs and stuff, so oh well. Um we shall see. So bear with me. So I took the liberty to add all the leaves actually also around the um, the bud that we have created. And what I was telling was it was it's too straight so you might want to, you know, just make it more organic and just bend um, the stem to your bush. I think it's pretty and so I'm just bending them like that so it will look more natural. Of course I have to bend mine and assemble it this way that it's facing towards me because I still have to take pictures. So that's how I assemble mine. Um, you know, because I have to take pictures and as you all know, pictures are from front, so there is no point of having some flowers at the back for me. So I'm just, you know, you can assemble them. Some people don't have a lot of time to make a big branch and I'm just looking how I'm gonna yeah. I think I'll do this so I will take another piece of tape and see how I am you know and your branch may be different than mine but that's okay, you know. I mean, no flower or plants are the same. You know, so... If your branch does not look as mine, don't worry. That's no big deal. <laughs> because... Am I out of screen all the time? I'm sorry about that try to stay in so I've just decided to put the shortest one up and give this one I will cut this off but I have not decided where what um to use first what how do you call that what thing it is so as you can see I am securing it by wrapping that point very tight couple of times I will add this bamboo skewer because my could be that yours is very thin too so is my wire and I will just thicken it so it can hold the weight later on and I will add the the bud the same spot But in front, like I said, and I will thicken the stem with bamboo skewers so it can hold the whole flower because this one wire is just too small. And there you go. If your vase is not long enough or too, this is too short, you can always extend by, you know, extending this. Because of that, we can't bend this anymore, but that's 
That's fine with me. Let's see how cute is this, guys. Just gonna cut this piece off. I just think it's too long, so I I am gonna cut it. Though, so, yeah, just just here. I think that's enough. Oops. For me, it is because I think I know. Oh, maybe it was too short. Oh, we'll see. So before you start cutting, make sure you know where. You're, where know which face to use or what to do them um maybe i'm not even gonna place this in a vase and i'm just gonna place it on my botanical wall i have this wall with all almost all the flowers that i made of course not everything goes up there like i said botanical so some flowers be go there now you want to reposition the leaves um so you know you have leaves on all places and there you go you have yourself a camellia branch and if you want you could also just have a container let me show you for example this one you, you can create three of these branches so like so in total of six flowers and three buds and just cover this area with um, dried moss and you have a little plant as you can see see that's cute right so See, I need to clean this all up because there used to be flowers in here. There. And there you go. You have yourself a camellia branch with a bud. And very easy, very simple, but very 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 cute there you go so yeah I'm sorry about the um, that there's a part four could have ended before but oh well it happens you know it's not a disaster maybe a bit unpleasant to watch but oh well um, thank you again for ordering this flower and if you are a if you have a membership then you'll thank you and I hope you enjoy making this flower too I'm looking forward to see your creations and it's pretty easy as you saw um, so yeah do like the, um, the green here, the green accent. Wish I've done it all, but I might, it was dark when I did it, so I might have used the wrong color. But uh, so, and the sepal, don't forget the sepal. I didn't do my sepal because no one's gonna see it, so I did cheat a bit. Um, yes. Um, thank you again. If you like in, um, this design, if you enjoyed making this flower, please head back to my Etsy shop and leave a review. I would really appreciate that. Thank you very much. Um, do like the tutorial and if you have any tips, leave a comment. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. So thank you again and have fun making this flower. And uh, hopefully see you next time. Bye.